Hi, Joanna Hodorowska, Nutrition in Motion, Nutrition for Body, Mind, Spirit, and Sport. So today, temperatures are pretty hot, hot, hot. And I went for one of my longest rides this year, which was just about 50 miles. And, you know, I went with my friend Grace, and I know what my hydration needs, but they're completely different than what she needs. And luckily on, on the ride, we were trying to decide where to go, and I said, well, let's go that way, because then we can stop at the Wawa, and I can get ice, and I can get, um, and what I wanted was, you know, something to, to refill my, my bottles. And, you know, I have two of these on my bike, and I had them filled with ice in my, um, and my sports drink and my extra base salt because that's what I um, am using now and that really works well for me. And I ended up going on, it, it was, you know, three and a half, four hour ride. And I ended up having four of these bottles on that ride. Grace, on the other hand, only had one bottle with her the whole time. And when we stopped, she just, you know, didn't need anything else, and I did. I ate half a bar, a couple of potatoes, had my Red Bull, because that's what I wanted, and was fine. But I was still kind of dying, and half the time, every time I felt tired, I know I needed another dose of electrolytes, because you're always going to dehydrate before you're going to run out of fuel. But I needed to take more hydration, more electrolytes than she does. And part of me, I know, I know from doing my sweat testing with levelin.com that I sweat out at least 600 milligrams of sodium and electrolytes per hour. So if I am not taking in that amount, then I'm going to be dehydrating. And when I'm working with clients, generally speaking, I say, you know, your goal is to get one of these bottles, which is about 24 ounces in per hour. And sometimes it could be less, sometimes it could be more. But when it's hot, you have to pay attention to your signs of dehydration. And fatigue is one of them. Uh, so a lot of times you have to do what you need to do for your own rides and not pay attention to what somebody else is doing. Because if I drank one bottle like Grace did for the three and a half hour ride, I don't think I would have made it at all. Um, and it was hot, hot, hot today. So I want you to, you know, pay attention to how, how is it that you're feeling on your ride and you need to dictate where you're going to stop so that you can refill if you know that you need to have um, a stop two hours into your ride. So plan accordingly. If you don't know what your signs of de dehydration are, I can work with you to, to, to kind of um, figure that out. I also have a list on my website, which if you just put, I'll put it into the notes, but if you put your email down below, then I will send you the link for the signs of dehydration that are on my website. And I can also, you know, give you the, the code that you can get your level and sweat testing done so that you no longer just have to guess by what it is that you're feeling and how your um, body's responding to the heat and humidity. But you can actually find out specifically what your uh, sweat rate is and what your um, electrolyte needs are per hour. Then you can really dictate, okay, this is what I need and this is what I need to uh, accommodate during my rides. I need to plan that stop someplace where you can get ice, somewhere where you can get more fluids so that you can take care of you and your needs and so that you don't dehydrate and you can enjoy whatever distance ride you're doing. If you have questions about um, hydration and what works for you, uh, contact me, Joanna Hodorowska, nutritioninmotion.net, and we can work through what your signs of dehydration are and customize a plan specifically for you. So these are the lessons from the bike this morning. My hydration needs are not the same as Grace's, and Grace's hydration needs are obviously not the same as mine. But I have to do what I need to do so that I can enjoy the ride and not peter out. Um, and I can enjoy the ride because I know what my hydration needs are. Have any questions? Contact me. Enjoy the day. Time to hop in the pool.